Hey guys, this is me Ammar and welcome back to our channel Ampnix. In this video, we are going to discuss about the net tool in eCAD. Basically, nets are very important while designing the layouts or while designing the important signal tracks. In schematic, it is also very important to use the net tool so that we can verify that the specific wire or the specific uh, component is uh, connected with which terminal. As you can see, we have here a simple voltage regulator circuit or we can say a low dropout output. Okay, so in this, uh, we are using 12 volt DC input and 3.3 volt DC output. So we want to make the track, we want to notify, uh, add a net so that we can verify from where what is flowing. As you can see, the number one pin of this uh, screw terminal is connected to ground and this is connected to input voltage so we can add a net so that we can verify from where the input current is flowing and from where the output current is flowing so for adding the net there are two methods that you can use one is that you can directly add the place net level or you can just hit the shortcut key l so I'm gonna use this and it will ask what you want to write here. So what I can do here, I can just write N N 12V. Okay. And you can write it as for your signal. So I'm gonna place it here. And in the same way, I need one net here also. So I will click Ctrl plus D and what I will do. I will just double click here and I will change this. So this time I will make it out 3v3. Okay. So in this way you can add the nets. Okay. But if you are working on multiple sheets, sometimes it will happen that you are working in a complex PCB. So in that case scenario, you cannot use only one sheet. For that case scenario you will go for multiple sheet so when you go for multiple sheets so how can you use the net level so in that case scenario what you can do you can use the global net levels okay when you click here it will again ask you what you want to write here so you can just write here like whatever you want i will just write the input okay and just rotate it r and just delete this one delete the existing one and most of the time I use the global nets only because uh, it seems uh, quite convenient for me. So I'm a huge fan of using global nets and make sure to change it. Otherwise you cannot differentiate between input and output. So yes. Alright. So in this way you can use the net level. 